run away. Hey, welcome back to the channel. Okay, so you may notice that we're about in the same spot we were in the last video, and that's because something crazy happened that we wanted to make another video about. So we split it into two videos, and now you're gonna love this. It's a little crazy, but it's fun, and I'm tired because of it. So you probably saw by the first clip, but let's get into the video. a trick we're gonna try to jump right there I don't know if it's gonna do it but we're gonna try he's going over the toilets <laughs> Where's he going? Oh! Well, there goes the light bar. Wow. <laughs> still fine other than the light bar. And here comes some spectators down the field. Uh oh, he may have found something else. He bent the plastic a little bit. I don't know if you could hear him or not. All right, bring her back over here so you don't have to carry it. Rip, ripped off the zip ties for the night light on the front. That's an easy fix. You don't start back up and bring her on over. Two, one. Uh oh, he had a runaway. Runaway. I hope it runs out of gas. I ain't walking all the way over there. Don't know where it's going. Well, lesson learned for today. We need to install those kill switches. Oh, good. It stopped. Three days later. Here he comes. All right, so what happened? Talk to me. I'll tell you in a minute. The walk of shame. Somebody didn't have a kill switch. The walk of shame. So we'll find out what happened over here. It wouldn't have mattered if I had a kill switch or not. What happened? I think the, the wreck caused the battery to disconnect. And so when I started it up again, it just took off. Had no, no electronics at all. Nothing. Yeah. How, how did it stop? Uh, I'm not sure. It just, the luck of... The, it, hit some, <laughs> it hit some real thick hay grass over there, made it turn to the left, kept going, and then just died. So. Thank God for that, because otherwise it'd hit something down there, a tree or something. Wow. Oh, I think it's heavy. Yeah, you had a long walk, so. <laughs> yeah. Okay, now that, you know, this thing isn't running, we're gonna have to take it back to the shop and diagnose what's wrong with it, see if there's any underlying pieces that are broke. So let's get back to the shop. Okay, now that we got this thing back to the studio, let's start looking at what we broke. So we're gonna take the body off and dive in. So let's get at it. Look at that grass. Yeah, it's not as bad as the ball haul though. Yeah, it sucked up a lot over in that hay field when it took off on you. Yeah, a, a lot of it was all balled up right here in the back, but I pulled it out before I even started walking with it. But man, I tell you what, it still, still rolls just fine. It still looks just fine. I don't see any damage other than we need uh, a couple more zip ties to go back here. And uh, we gotta figure out what happened with the, uh, the power. So we'll take the battery out here in a second and try that. Otherwise, looking at the body here, we'll look at the, it did, did a little bit of damage. So this, it's supposed to look like this, but it's bent up and it did break right here, which, you know, we can 
I can heat that up and push that back down and fix it. That's not a problem. Um, that's, you know, right here, maybe a little bit, but that's the only spots that I can tell that it did any damage to the body. So that's good news. So it's not bad. Yeah, right there, did a little bit. But overall, body's in great shape. I had beat the crap out of this thing. If you don't remember, I jumped it, I, I broke the, uh, I broke the, the plug, I, I broke the, the sway links in the back. I mean, I have flipped it and so many times. And uh, so the clips you're seeing right now is just me over and over again, just destroying this thing. And it has been a tank. So overall, this thing is awesome. I love it. So far, it's I've done a number on it. It's still kicking, so that's great. I don't see any broken pieces. Uh, the only problem I had with it was that the uh, the electronics cut off, so it wouldn't have matter if I had a kill switch or not, but we are going to put a kill switch on these suckers because just in case. It wouldn't matter this time, but it might. So let's uh, take the battery out, see what electronics are messed up, and then we'll go from there. Jimmy's about to do his favorite thing, sucking. Get the grass out. Get the grass out. <laughs> Okay, let's let's uh, open up the electronics and see what's going on in there. There's my uh, battery, but okay, pay no attention to the battery. Uh, yes, I know that it's bloated, but it still works, so I'm going to get a new one. But it is off right now. Oh, oh no, it's still connected. What the heck? Still connected back in here, so I'm not sure. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Yeah, I, th I think it, it barely, it was barely connected. I think it came loose. So let's put it back together, see if it was just loose and that was it, and see if it works now. Let's try it out. Hold on. Okay. Okay, so we got, we got power to the receiver. Okay. Power to the receiver, so let's go from there. We've tried everything we can think of, even swapping out receivers. The only, only thing we can think of is this battery, see how puffed it is? We think that that was the reason. So we did go ahead and charge it a little bit. It did take some charge. And we think the battery just went dead because look, everything's working again. So I did not destroy my Kraken like I thought, but I did destroy the battery. So this thing is getting replaced because this is dangerous and that's scary. Like it's hard as a rock and I don't want to uh, burn my car down. So I'm gonna be ordering a new one plus a uh, nickel metal hydride backup because I wanna make sure that, uh, or NICAD, whatever, whichever one is available for this size because I wanna make sure that I have a primary and a backup just in case something like this happens so but that did give us a pretty good scare in the importance of a kill switch yeah it wouldn't have mattered in this case but still it should we, we we do need one so we already have some we have like what two or three of them i think we got the, yeah, three of them. yeah three of them so we're going to go ahead and start putting them in our cars and then ordering them for the future so with that said that's going to do it for this video i hope you enjoyed it hope you enjoyed my pain for your game so God bless you, God bless America, be empowered, out. Here you go, Jimmy. You see that? Oh my gosh, look how big that is. Here it goes. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh.